In this video, we'll find the number of protons, electrons for Rb+, the rubidium ion. We'll also look at neutral rubidium as well. The first thing we should note is that on the periodic table, this 37, that's the atomic number for rubidium. So 37 is our atomic number, and that's the same for the rubidium ion as well. That's the same for any atom of rubidium. If we look at the atomic number for rubidium, the atomic number, that equals the number of protons. So if we have 37 as our atomic number, that means we have 37 protons as well. And it doesn't really matter if we have an atom or an ion, we're always going to have 37 protons for rubidium. The electrons, that's what's going to be different between an atom and an ion. So to figure the electrons out, we know that if we have a neutral atom, like Rb here, that the number of electrons and protons, they're going to be the same. So we can just write 37 electrons in for Rb. But for Rb+, plus, this plus here, that tells us we've lost one electron. Think about it. If electrons are negative, you lose a negative charge, and you become positive. So instead of 37 electrons, we have 36 for the rubidium ion, Rb+. Plus. If you need help finding the number of neutrons for the different isotopes of rubidium, there's a link in the description to a video to help you do that. This is Dr. B with the number of protons and electrons for Rb+, plus, the rubidium ion. Thanks for watching.